Congratulations to the Los Angeles Lakers winning another title. This will be LeBron's fourth title, Lakers' 17th overall. I know some people are going to say it's for Kobe and everything like that, and that's great and all. But this team, the Lakers, beating the Heat in six games, I, I said this series is going to go six games at least. I did think. I did kind of pull for the underdog here. You know, Jimmy Butler, Gore Dragic. Um, who got injured, Bam Adebayo, you know, who also kind of got injured, Jay Crowder, Tyler Hero, you know, Andre Iguodala, you know, don't, don't completely count those guys out, you did a fantastic job, especially Jimmy Butler, oh, and uh, Duncan Robinson as well, who shoots up threes, you know, at every second, I swear, um, but yeah, you know, Eric Spolcher's Eric Spolstra did a great job bringing this team to the finals. Congrats to the Heat. You you got you got there. You came up short. You know, still a good season. Come back next year, things will be fine. Come back next year, and who knows, y'all could win a title. But man, man, oh man, oh man, LeBron and Anthony Davis. This was. The Anthony Davis show for about two of these games, at the very least. You know, LeBron was being LeBron. He was getting triple doubles every night and stuff like that and just bawling out. But the supporting cast around him, aside from AD, you got Dwight Howard, Rajon Rondo, Katerius Caldwell Pope, Kyle Kuzma, Alex Caruso. Man. Man, 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 man. And Frank Vogel and company did a great job, you know, just limiting the heat, keeping, you know, the other players around the heat that weren't Jimmy Butler. I mean, they couldn't really contain Jimmy Butler all that much. But keeping other players, uh, lots of turnovers for the heat in, in, in most of these games. Lots of missed threes. Lots of bad mistakes. And, you know, I mean, it just is what it is. So... And people are going to discredit this ring. They already are discrediting this ring. Um, you shouldn't. This was a hard, hard series for both teams. I mean, we all thought, you know, that the Lakers would easily cruise by the by the Heat and everything like that. This series ended up going to six games anyway. Especially, you know, the Heat had lost Dragic and Adebayo. Um, to injury for at least two of these games. And they still did, you know, just what they could. And, I mean, again, no no discredit to the Heat at all. They did what they needed to do to try and win a championship. They just came up short. And, unfortunately, three of these games were basically blowouts. I mean, I'm not going to lie to you. You know, the Lakers' defense was suffocating at times. Very, very suffocating, and especially Anthony Davis. I'm not sure I haven't paid attention since I am watching Sunday Night Football right now. Um, yeah, I don't know who won finals MVP. I'm hoping it's Anthony Davis. But anyway, hopefully the next NBA season should start on Christmas, if not New Year's Day or something like that, or around that time. Around that time period, Christmas to New Year's. I'm hoping it's Christmas so we can get some high-quality games, you know. And there's going to be a lot of teams that are going to be in it for next year, of course, because it's the NBA. But the narrative has kind of changed, but not really. I mean, I mean the Lakers won their first island in years. I mean, it's not very long. And, I mean, it's, it's crazy to think that 10 years ago, you know, the Lakers last won their title. Crazy to think it's also been that almost the same amount of time because the Mavs won the next year, I think, that the Mavs won the title, you know, because they won it in 2011. But yeah, that's going to do it. The NBA Finals was great for, you know, a couple of games of the series. The other three were just kind of meh, kind of blowouts. And, I mean, just... 
just give it up for, you know, for the NBA to make it through the bubble in Orlando. They they did wonders. We'll, hopefully, we'll see them again on Christmas. Hopefully, I really hope we do. To be completely honest, and hope we have another good NBA season for 2020-2021. So, that being said, see y'all tomorrow. College football. And then Tuesday or Wednesday, probably Wednesday, will be an NFL recap. Thursday will be, um, since there's no Thursday night football game, but we'll talk about that when we talk about the NFL um, in its own separate video. There won't be a Thursday night football game on Thursdays. So that's a good thing. So, see y'all later on in the week.